Hello. Uh, after this uh, blues rock in E7, uh, you've heard um, a few times uh, chord inversions. And uh, so we, we start at the lowest position in the first uh, E7 position. So you get your, uh, your shape uh, in the first row. It's uh, You put the first finger on G string on first fret and uh, the uh, pinky on uh, fret 3 on B string and the highest string, the E string, is empty. So we have this shape. This is uh, also possible in an octave where you um, then you have uh, also your second finger here and you just try this out, uh, you get the same shape an octave higher. You have to use just uh, your fingers to get the 12th fret done. So the next position is, uh, we call this a, a D shape. Uh, you have your uh, third finger on uh, fret 4 and the uh, G string, your first finger on fret 3 on B string and your third finger on fret 4. So this is the shape, yeah? The next shape uh, you could earn is uh, here on uh, first finger on fret 5 and uh, the second finger, so I have to stretch a little bit on uh, fret 7 and the third finger on fret uh, 7 too. So this is this shape. You have to stretch a little bit, so. And then uh, the next uh, shape is on fret 9 with your first finger on a G string a fret fret 9 your second finger on B string fret 9 and uh, your third finger on fret 10 but you can do it also as a half berry uh, then you have uh, the first finger completely on fret 9 and you just put your second finger on fret 10 so it's also possible now these are the uh, the most easiest uh, chord inversions on the three highest uh, strings. Uh, we call this also string set. So you might use this. <laughs>